Black Americans had been part of aviation long before the famous Charles Lindbergh learned to fly. But many Americans believed, like Lindbergh, that blacks were somehow not suited for aviation. Most white Americans didn't know that during World War I, a black American, Eugene Bullard from Columbus, Georgia, served with the French Lafayette Esquadrille and was decorated with the Croix de Guerre. Nor did white Americans know about Bessie Coleman, who earned her international pilot's license in 1922, also in France. But black Americans knew, and they came out by the thousands to see her exhibition flights across the United States. And while there were many other pioneers, Charles Alfred Anderson and John Forsythe, Herman Banning and Thomas Allen, among others, it was Bessie Coleman who became the inspiration for a legion of black aviators. And one of these aviators would lead the efforts to integrate the U.S. Army Air Corps and even made possible the creation of the famous Army Training Facility at Tuskegee Institute in Alabama. Her name was Willa Beatrice Brown. <laughs>